All right, so I've been looking around at pawn shops and thrift stores and stuff, trying to find a, a beat up old guitar that would be perfect to restore and bring to life. And I think I found the perfect one. And uh, here we go. This is the, the Kramer Guitar Hero. Yeah, everybody's seen these. Anybody who's ever actually played a real guitar hates these because all those idiots in high school that were obsessed with this game thought they could play guitar for real. Uh, I'm going to turn this into a... I'm going to call it a gent stick, not a real guitar, because, uh, well, clearly I'm not going to be able to put six strings on it. So I'm thinking two or three strings maybe, maybe four, probably not four, two or three strings. Uh, and uh, a pickup, turn it into a real guitar. Uh, well, that's using the term lightly. Uh, so I'm going to, the neck actually just comes out pretty easy, it's one of those. So I'm going to work on the body gut it out, see if I can put some real, real instrument parts on there. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. So it's time to go into my junk drawer here and find me a pickup to use. Uh, these. I think it's going to be, you know, these are wired hot, so they'll be a little bit louder. These are like bridge pickups. I think I'm going to put one of these in there. Let's see. These are just, I've got a couple old random pickups here from, I don't even know where they came from, most of them, but we use one of these two. Which one's got a longer cord? Uh, yeah, it's going to be, actually I'm going to use the one with the shorter cord just because uh, the one with the longer cord I might need to use on a real guitar. I don't know what this uh, pickup came from, but it's uh, it's got a little, it's Pretty set in there, it's got a pick guard ring around it already. Alright, here's a pick guard. Got that. And that fits perfectly. Like it's kind of big, so I can actually but that that pick guard ring there actually covers that hole perfectly. So that's 
yeah that is ideal that's perfect so I'm just gonna get a Dremel tool cut this out so the pickup pickup fits in there too and then I'm gonna mount it with some screws onto the pick guard right, that really did work out perfect I'm glad it had this ring I don't know what kind of guitar that's from but that ring fit it perfectly you can see how much space there is on around the outside of the pickup but that worked perfect so now I just need to trim this out right here and that shouldn't be that big of a problem I can trim it out pretty good and then uh, then I can have the uh, the pick guard cover all the damage <laughs>
so uh, here it is. It is complete and it's wired up. Got the knobs. because I did put bass strings on it. I just threw some random strings on there. So I think there's a, a D, G, and then an A from a regular six string guitar. So yeah, it's, it's completely functional. All the way, all the way up the fretboard. Well, not that one. I can't believe how good that sounds actually. That pickup's kind of impressive considering it's a jump drawer pickup that I just randomly pulled out of a box and stuck in here. I am stoked the way this came out. So let's cut over to Jacob and see if he can write a song on it. 